Hi Li Yuling, this is my PC, this is my desktop. This looks like a Mac, but it's actually a PC. Well, uh, I suppose that you have already downloaded Daemon Tools. Then you should double click it. And right in the system tray, you will see a red lightning button. It is the Daemon Tools. This is the blue one, and this is the uh, red one. And you right click it and you choose the uh, virtual CD and DVD ROM and then you choose the device and uh, this letter might be different because I have uh, C, disk, D, E and F so uh, a virtual CD is actually system H okay this is my DVD and uh, physical it's somehow called a physical driver but this is the virtual driver okay then you see here right now this is no media no media and then I have to mount image then I click mount image and uh, because you know the default setting the default setting is all images right the file type and uh, because and then you have to set it to all files so that you can see Collins.ir and so that IR is the uh, abnormal extension for such CD files and then you click on it and then you click open right now it's opened so uh, and you can see that uh, it's already shown the Collins CoBuild 3 this icon very nice uh, because I've already installed it in my computer so um, you will not see a pop-up installation um, question and answer panel but uh, if it's your first time to, uh, to install it then you should see that happening uh, but because of uh, the auto run .exe that kind of uh, application already you run it yesterday or the day before yesterday so uh, it might cause a little bit of a problem so you might go to the control panel and you go to the uh, add or uninstall software and you delete remember you have to uninstall you have to uninstall the uh, already installed Collins CoBuild 3 and then you go through this process again and you do this and then you should see this happening okay uh, this could be a, a bit of a problem and then when you installed you can go to the uh, well uh, since you have already got this uh, daemon tools running you do not have to install it to its fullest version um, r you have to just uh, install say run from CD-ROM and choose that option it should be okay and then you click uh, menu and you go to here right Collins CoBuild on CD-ROM and then you click on it right you are in uh, Collins CoBuild lexicon and then uh, a little bit uh, tricky here you click edit and you can click options um, here are some things you can configure and then you can click font okay and you can uh, choose the uh, default font size um, bold, italic or here okay right so this is that's all uh, should you have any other questions leave me a message on the forum bye bye